Listen, man. Plus six minutes. Pulse is 45. Respiration 10. Looking good, Cole.
while sliding into unconsciousness, I could somehow, I don't know, hear the voices of the dying. Thousands crushed by falling buildings or burned alive in the fires. Trish lost her sister, almost lost me. Zeke was always there, somehow sure that I'd wake up while outside the city fell apart. A plague struck, followed by rioting, theft, rapes, civilization committing suicide. In a bullshit attempt to contain the biological threat, the federal government locked down all access in and out of the city, and we were stuck in this cage with the psychos. Cops are all but gone off the streets, either dead or too chicken shit to stand against the gangs that control things now. Outside, things were bad. But inside, inside me, something was beginning. Scary as hell at first. You gotta understand, there was no one to talk to, no experts to consult. But with time, I'm learning to control it, master it. Just hope it's not too late. I thought you were gonna watch TV. Ah, batteries are dead again. Uh, you mind putting on a freak show? Sure. I'm glad it's good for something. Probably need to charge them all. TV's a hog. to see how much juice you're packing. Next gives a crap about us. This is a PR stunt. That isn't gonna stop you from pigging out, though, is it? <laughs> Hell no, it ain't. Zeke's gotta eat. You take the stairs. I'm using the express elevator. Oh, man, get to have all the fun. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> 